Native American legend has some weird and spooky creatures, creatures they could never think of. Here are five of the scariest creatures from Native American legend. Number one, Lechuza. Owls are used to represent death in Native American culture. The Lechuza is a witch that turns into owls. It is mostly around Native American legends in Texas and Mexico. The Lechuza is often said to be associated with mysterious occurrences and deaths. Reports around the area of Texas and Mexico say that odd owls appear before they have car trouble or anything else mysterious. Number 2. Pervert Merman The damn Kinawet might not be dangerous, but it is creepy. The perverted merman hides out near rivers and streams to uh, creep on people bathing in them. Just imagine the sight of a merman watching you while you wash yourself. The merman also has magical powers. To remove those magical powers, you have to remove their clothing. Ugh, this creature is all sorts of wrong. Number 3, Wendigo. Depending on which Native American tribe, the Wendigo can be described differently. It can be described as giants with never-ending hunger, or as a violent cannibalistic spirit associated with cold and hunger. Either way, the Wendigo seems to represent the sins of gluttony and greed. Humans could also become Wendigos by spending time with them, or by being controlled by greed. So remember kids, sharing is caring, or else you'll turn to a giant cannibalistic spirit. Number 4. The Two-Face In Siuk's legend, a two-face is a humanoid creature with a face in front and in back. Anyone who makes contact with the face in the back will be paralyzed or shocked to death. The two-face kills its victims with its incredibly sharp elbows and sometimes cannibalizes them. Another version is in Lakota legend. After attempting to seduce a sun god, a woman turns into a monster with one beautiful face and one monstrous one. The two faces represent disharmony and departure from tradition. Number 5. Skinwalkers Skinwalkers are medicine men and witches who have achieved the highest level of sorcery but choose to go to the dark side. Before becoming a skinwalker, they must kill a close one. Once they complete this ritual, they gain unbelievable powers, they get immortality, and the ability to turn to any animal, mainly crows and wolves. Once they become skinwalkers, they attempt to harm people or frighten them. Although they are immortal, they can still be killed. They can be killed by reading out the full name of the said skinwalker. Once that happens, the skinwalker will pay for their wrongdoings by being inflicted with disease and dying. Hey what's up guys it's Beyond 7 Day here and if you enjoy this video then please leave a like and if you want to see more content like this then please subscribe and that's it for me. Peace.